and we've only known our PAP for 10 years. I cannot imagine trying to do the work that we're doing now without the support of, of our PAP. So when we first started, it was a life raft. It was in a time, 2011, when we had nine doctors in town and seven of those nine doctors decided that it was time to either retire or go back to school. So we were gonna be down to two doctors. And it was at a time when the province of Alberta was short about 200 doctors. So the competition was gonna be really keen for, for rural doctors. And uh, the lifeboat part was, well, let's call up RPAP because we know that they, they can help with locums, but we don't know what else they can do. At that very first meeting, uh, we had our, our um, RPAP area rep that said, okay, here's what you do. And number one, and number two, and we did the top 10 things that it would take to become uh, an RPAP committee, and we called ourselves an RPAP committee. In that first year of recruiting, we recruited 25% of the doctors that were recruited in, in Alberta for rural hospitals. So uh, yeah, it was pretty successful. The work they do for getting locums in, for helping rural doctors actually get some holiday time or off to do some training. Uh, the public never never hears about that. That's something that, that stays within the profession. And even the work that we've done in the community for, for recruiting and, and all of the other things that have sprung from that original RPAP group that we call SPARC, again, the public really doesn't know that RPAP was behind that. For those of us that are our recruitment teams, and they are all across the province, we know exactly what, what RPAP is. RPAP has always brought some dollars along with it to say, you know, it's an award, but with that, we want to see a celebration as well to get everybody together and just have a, have a really good time. And all of that just reminds the community for just that period of time that we have healthcare professionals here that work hard and we appreciate them and we need more of them and we'll do our part to attract them and to keep them in our community.